Hey guys, this is Hetu and welcome or welcome back to Itil QA Labs. So guys, uh, there was uh, some confusion. Uh, I think uh, I got some of the queries uh, that uh, uh, some of you are facing issues while installing the Informatica, especially when um, when you are trying to uh, unzip the zip number five, right? Zip, zip number four, basically one of four, right? So after uh, you know uh, unzipping this there is another zip file inside that right and when you try to unzip this you are getting some error weird error something related to volume or something right or uh, some might get something different some different error right and which is actually causing the error right so uh, here right what you have to do guys i think uh, if you take a look at uh, the original installation video that I have done I think I have tried to cover it but uh, just to clarify it so that you can get you know hundred percent sure what to do so what you have to do guys let's say you have got all these four files now after uh, unzipping this you are actually getting one of four one uh, two of four three of four four of four right one of four one of four it will come like dot z01 two will come like z02 dot z02 and one of three will come like dot z03 there is no problem with these three files right but when actually you go to one of four then you are getting another zip file and when you try to unzip it from here you are getting that error now right what you have to do is uh, this is not the way you have to unzip this particular file right this particular file okay what you have to do is you have to you have to create one more folder so what i have done i have uh, you know uh, created one more folder so here final copy and in this final copy I have copied uh, the these files basically that uh, dot zero zero one zero two zero three all these three files I have copied right first of all and then also I have to copy this particular file which is there inside one of four folder okay see here I have copied all these three now let me copy this also okay because I'll tell you why we have to do this. Now let me copy it. Okay. So why we have to do it because uh, this particular zip file, uh, which is in one of four, I think that zip file is very much dependent on these three files basically, which are uh, inside uh, this folder, right? One of two, one of one, one of two, one of three, right? So that is the reason we have to copy all these four files together okay so which all the files this files basically right so this file this file and uh, this file inside three right and inside four this zip file so what you will get it you will get all these files let's let's wait for copy to complete one second guys something went wrong Second, something went wrong. Looks like the no, not this one. <clears throat> okay, let me go back. Okay, what I have to do? I have to copy this. Where? Let me copy it. So, okay, let's wait. Yeah, because we have to copy this file first. Okay. So all these four files, once you copy, this three, uh, first three, this file uh, dot z z zero file format, and then last one from the one of four. Okay, let's wait for it to complete, and then we will see because uh, once you copy all of them into a final folder, or you can put any name, but the idea is to keep all the four files together so that you can it can find the dependency, right? Where is that? Hey, is that? I'm not getting that. One second. All right. So this is copied now, guys. Okay. Now what I have to do? Now uh, we are in this particular folder, right? That we have created and we copied all the content from all these four folders, right? Now, now we will try to unzip it because. This particular file is dependent on these three files basically. Okay, that's the reason we have to keep all of them together in a separate folder. So uh, that's why I created this final copy folder. And then now let's try to extract it. Okay, let's see. 
now see it's happening so uh, let's wait i think once completed i will show you because uh, after that we will get the uh, client and server uh, to folder and from there we can insta uh, install the client and server basically you can follow my videos uh, for rest of the steps basically there but this is something that i wanted to clarify because many of you wanted uh, this and had the confusion right i think a bit of tricky uh, that's the reason i think uh, you know uh, very valid questions from you as well i really appreciate that yeah so uh, let's uh, wait for it to complete okay So let's see guys, uh, client is done, server is actually happening now. Alright guys, so this is done. This file is now extracted and you see this folder has appeared here. Now, and now you see the client and server, you can easily extract them and then you can go for the installation and you also have the keys here, right? So for rest of the things, you can follow uh, the video, right? But uh, this is something I wanted to clarify right this particular step little bit tricky right so that's all for this video and hope you are able to do it and if you still need any help uh, do comment on this video so that i can uh, clarify if you still need any help i'm sure that uh, you know this is uh, uh, i mean i have covered i try to cover the uh, cover the things but if you still need any help don't hesitate uh, please uh, put your comments so that i can cover cover that right Alright guys, thank you, thank you for watching and uh, happy learning, God bless you.